Hey, Katie. How are you doing today? Yeah. <laughs> well, either way. I just wanted to ask you real quick. You haven't been having any more, like, crazy catnip withdrawals, have you? No. So, so no more tremors, no more nightmares, or restless paw syndrome? No. Or... Okay, good. Good, Kitty. Because I figured that it would probably be in everybody's best interest if I went ahead and got all the catnip together and just threw it away. And so I did. What? I said I threw away the catnip because I figured, you know, you weren't going to need it anymore. What? I threw away the catnip because I figured... What? Sylvester, no. We are not going to argue, all right? Didn't you just say that you're not even having any withdrawals anymore? Yeah. Then <laughs> what difference does it make? Oh, Kitty. Besides, there's something else i got to talk to you about. I'll do that in a minute, all right? I sure love my kitty, kitty, kitty. So it's been a rough couple of months. Sylvester's catnip addiction is worse than any of us expected, but luckily he's been doing a little better lately. However, today is his semi-annual checkup with the vet, and he's not going to like that. I better go break the news to him. Sylvester, kitty, what are you doing? Come on. What are you looking for your catnip? Stay out of the trash. Sylvester, come here for a second. Kitty, what did I tell you about getting into the trash? Don't. Yet you did? Yeah. Stop it. Okay. <laughs> I forgive you, Kitty. Besides, you have an appointment today with the veterinarian. Remember her? She's that nice lady that makes sure you're healthy. We take you there every once in a while. You remember her? No. Sure you do. She sticks the thermometer right up your butt, remember? Fuck that. <laughs> do you remember her, though? Yeah. Well, today we have to go back. So I need you to get ready, and then we're going to hop in the truck. We're going to head over there, and it'll be over before you know it. What do you say? No. Kitty, come on, we're go Sylvester. Kitty, Sylvester, you're going to the vet. Whether he likes it or not, he's going to the vet. I just might have to get a little tricky. Sylvester, Kitty. Yeah? Hey, I'm really sorry about earlier. You know what? You don't have to go to the vet. Good! <laughs> that make you feel better? Yeah. I figured it would. Also, there's something else. What? I found the catnip. What? I found it. Yeah, I thought I threw it away, but then I found it. Where? It's actually out in the garage. Come here. I'll show you right where. Come on, follow me. Come here, kitty kitty. Look, I'm really sorry for tricking you. Yes. Sylvester. Come on, kitty. You know, I only do this because I love you, right? No. Well, I do. Okay. Kitty, who's my favorite kitty kitty kitty? Fuck off. Oh, come on. All right, here we are. So, Kitty, we're... Sylvester! Sylvester! Damn it! Great. Sylvester! Kitty! Shit! I can't believe he actually jumped out of the truck. He must really hate going to the vet. But luckily he hasn't eaten yet today, so chances are it's not going to be very long before he... I'm coming! Kitty, welcome home! How did you get here so fast? And how the hell do you knock so damn hard? Wow, Kitty, that was a long walk. I know. And it's so cold out there, too. Oh, Kitty. I'll bet you're super tired and super hungry, too, huh? Yeah. <laughs> well, guess what, Kitty? I got a treat for you. On my way home, I stopped and got some fresh tuna fish. It'll probably make you feel better, so wh what do you say? You want some? Yeah. All right, it's in the garage. Go ahead and head on in there, and I'll just meet you. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> Kitty, you fell for it again. Damn. Yeah, I'm sorry, Kitty, but I put a bungee cord on your door so it won't open, so don't try to jump out, all right? Fuck. <laughs> yeah, I know how you feel. You're going to the vet, Kitty. Hey guys, I'm Steve. So Sylvester's appointment went off without a hitch. It turns out he's completely healthy and extremely pissed off at me. Kitty, Sylvester, come on. So what, you're just not gonna talk to me now? No. Sylvester, come on, I said I was sorry. Kitty. He'll get over it. However, next month is Gibson's little trip to the vet, although I doubt he's gonna put up much of a fight. So thank you so much for watching and for your patience in between videos. And if you like this video, please share with your friends. And uh, other than that, I guess we'll see you guys soon.